form and number one on the scoring charts. Can he do it again today, live on EA TV? Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And with the Spanish League season about to reach its conclusion, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Granada taking on Real Madrid. Well, what a season it's been, Derek. We've seen everything. Drama at both ends of the table, some spectacular goals and plenty of entertainment. The players, of course, will be looking forward to a break now, but hopefully not before they give us a good game today. Melendo. Messeguer. Lokonga. Flores with it. Real come away with it. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Emeric Laporte starts alongside Rafael Varane in central defence. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And goal news to bring you, in this case from the Athletic Bilbao match, Alex Scott. Yeah, it's a goal for the Thanks as always to Alex Scott. Well, it's a great chance here, and don't these fans know it? And, and turned onto the woodwork. Well, confirmation as we look at the table of newly crowned champions. I say that, but today is the day when they'll receive that much coveted piece of silverware. And then, Stuart, the party can really start in earnest. Yes, it will, but they'll still want to put in a good performance today just to put the icing on the cake. It's been a great season for them, and they fully deserve their title to win. They're worthy winners. Can he play it in? Real Madrid had a spring in their step last time out as they won against Getafe. How might this one go, Stuart? Well, that 2-0 victory at home was not as easy as the scoreline suggests. They were just better in both boxes. I think they have to be favourites for the three points again today. They have far too much quality in their squad. Messeguer. Dieng. And he saw the situation developing. Well, they might be onto something. Now, will they do it from here? And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. He's driven in the corner. Putting his body on the line. And the attempt just wide. So unfortunate. Melendo. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Promising position, this. Can he put them in front? Yes, is the emphatic answer. And you have to say, it was on the cards. Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. Action underway once more. A wake-up call for the Real players, maybe. Can they find a response now? And so the sound of the half-time whistle, we're at the midway point here at the Nuevo Estadio de los Carmenes. Now, will they do it from here? And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say... Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Oh, showing excellent vision. And he finds the net. 
He could hardly miss. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. I'm just hearing there's been a goal at the Coliseum, Alfonso Perez. Here's Alex Scott. It's a goal for Getafe. They've scored the opener here with 51 minutes played. Alex with the info as ever. Corner for Real Madrid. And oh, it's in! We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. So the game continues, and that goal puts a different complexion on the match for Real. Bamba Dieng. And very deftly cut out. He's got the right idea with that pass. Well, it is an occasion never to be missed, and you'll see it live with us right here on EA TV, the Champions League final. It's Real Madrid facing Manchester City. Well, the two best teams in Europe are there on merit, but who will be the champions? It should be an absolute belter. Determined defending. Vinicius. And now Rodrigo. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Just not looking confident in possession. Can they create something from here? Well, the situation has changed in one of the other games. Here's Alex Scott with the news. Yes, it's another goal for Barcelona. It was a nice one-two, and then he coolly slotted it around the goalkeeper. They're ahead by two now, with 74 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Foul there, free kick awarded. Both substitutes have been getting ready, will come on at the same time. Just 10 minutes to go. This might be ideal for the counter. A long way out. Well, tremendous block. Player in the way again. Can he convert? Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Well, there was the chance for the equaliser, but you have to say, what a great save that was. Well, in possession now and looking to create something of their own. The cross is on. Well, they couldn't make anything of that cross with the ball. And there's the final whistle. In a way, this game had an academic quality about it. Everyone here, including the players, just waiting for the moment when they can celebrate their accomplishments. The trophy will soon be theirs. Well, it's been a long wait, but it's worth it. Celebrating in front of their own fans. They've been excellent this season. They fully deserve to be the champions. And that is a vivid picture of what we associate with this group of players. It's all about the team ethic. You can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Now, 